Well, it started in the basement of our first of our house in Spokane, and uh, I remember Coach View would, you know, his boys would come over and they'd call our house the School of Hard Knocks, <laughs> and they'd go down in the basement and you know uh, they just get after it playing hoops. And yeah, they they used to have some colossal battles and then battles out in the driveway that that you know they would end usually the same. <laughs> and uh, we'd always play one on one, and, and always end up in a fist fight. So, and then we ended up playing each other last year, Timberland versus BK, and it was just, it was like, it was super enjoyable because I knew I could talk trash, and he couldn't hit me because he'd be ejected. So, it was, it was a nice feeling knowing that I wouldn't get punched. That's one of the reasons like got me so competitive because he would always push me to like become a better player, and he was al he's always been bigger than me, like stronger. So. I'd always, I'd always have to find like ways to score and, and uh, shoot around him, but he's always been bigger than me, so that's probably what's got me more competitive. Me and Max probably spend hours on hours on hours every week just in here shooting together, and, and probably some of our best bonding time is just when we just rebound for each other, get in the gym, shoot with each other, play one-on-one. -on -one. That kind of stuff, I mean, you can't even, like, put a value on how good it is to be able to just spend that kind of time with your brothers. I mean, a lot of families have something they do together, but like we really, our lives are basketball, so. Well, you know, that's a unique thing because there's, we, I mean, this is all we do. <laughs> and uh, I said to my wife, you know, some, some days I wish I could go to a dance recital or something <laughs> other than a basketball. So I leave here and go to another basketball game and then, and she just, that's all she does too, so.